we all know that pomegranate fruit uh, had some beneficial health effects. And in our study, we confirmed some of these effects, uh, like uh, anti-inflammatory effects, uh, lowering uh, uh, cholesterol, lowering uh, sugar. We have realized that some of the uh, compounds chemically identified in those extracts uh, uh, showed significant antiviral activities against some other and different viruses. So uh, we decided to test our compounds on SARS-CoV-2. We said that uh, uh, those compounds had the potential to, to inhibit this uh, process. But it's a part of a puzzle. At this point, our aim or idea is uh, to use it as a prevention, as a supplement for uh, decreasing the risk of getting infected. It's hard to say if you eat uh, pomegranate, if that would be enough to prevent infection. But eating fruits, uh, many polyphenols uh, from other uh, plant sources like uh, green tea or uh, coffee uh, is also uh, known to have some antiviral uh, activity. So uh, when you mix all that, uh, maybe you can uh, protect yourself in some way to decrease the risk of getting infection.